Hello and welcome back. This is Ruboice Runner playing Samrost after our brief delay to play Depict 1. And we are back to solving the dilemma of two worlds colliding in this giant journey across the magical realm of Asian outcrops and Himalayan moon mountains. And now we're in our deciduous forest filled with different worms and hooty owls and birds galore lovely looking and wonderful and mysterious and majestic and Mr. Pajama Hat Man is hiding in his little cave from the giant animals kinda like an old-fashioned 1930s or 40s dinosaur film where the cavemen have to fend for themselves and oh looky here we have what would appear to be a hybrid human squirrel monster and he's uh, got a new taste for music, got a taste for the classics, and uh, we can click on the red button. And let's see uh, what Mr. Man has to play here. We have some uh, criminal detective sounding music, some elevator with a little bit of mystery and intrigue as we uh, wait to see who's turning that dark alleyway and looking behind our shoulder. And we can click on some more. Let's see what else he's got. Ah, some classical romantic interlude to offset the mysterious mysteries of the forest and its dark descent into hell. And let's see what else we have here. Ooh, we got a fast jazz pace jive. Ooh, I didn't mean to click him. Oh, we're back to our old fashioned. Let's go back to that last one. And our romance, ah, uh, romance with the human squirrel. Ooh, and Mr. Hootie's acting. Well, we woke up Mr. Hootie. Ooh, I can click on him. And he's a hopping around and taking a stroll about town. And ooh, now we are approaching what looks like Anteater World meets Jurassic Park little thingamajig here. It looks reminds me of Jurassic Park, one of the little outposts they would have with our little stairwell with mystery and intrigue leading upwards. So we will attempt to go, I guess, hopefully, I guess we go inside of this little magical box here and find out maybe what makes this whole place tick. So thanks for watching and see you soon.